shooting early with their yeah. left hands. Hooking and yeah, jabbing. Yeah, powerful shots, very well placed. No. Herrera throwing his left hook right under Marquez's heart. Marquez. All the way around fighters both kind of punch very well. Both, both can box or punch. Hard right hand by Sugar Ray Leonard, who is as quickly Herrera does. And a lot of times, it looks like he's getting hit when he doesn't. He has a, that's why he's been through a lot of those fights without getting hit clean. All of the punishment that people think he's taking. Left jab is beating Marquez to the On the line, you can feel it. In here so many times before. Front, Marquez countered with a quick left hook. This fight is going to be very, very right special. Hand. Both guys are punching extremely hard and over it in one second. Well, not terribly surprised. Morales four. It's very simple. Right there, you saw. Right here, you see Marquez laying a sweeping right hand on Marrero right there. And Marrero got hit with the punch. And if he keeps. Seven, Marquez 20 out of 62. Marquez throwing just a little bit more. Barrera has landed 14 power shots. In other words, lit his chin away from the impact. Barrera stepping in. Barrera looks very sharp and very. Dude in Big Bear, California. He compared this training camp to the other two hardest training camps of his career. And sometimes he throws the left hook to the body because Mark. Shots countering to the body. I think that due by being the aggressor because he found. Those of them right now. There's a left hook to the body getting back with the left hook. counters with two left hooks of his own. Stop. All that often. Good left hook to the body inside by the big stuff. Barrera sticking to. I have the feeling, Emmanuel, that Barrera is the more relaxed fighter. Glory that he has. I don't think I've ever saw him faster with his hand speed than he has now. Barrera making Marquez reach and then stepping Look at inside. That. And tattooing him with hard shots. That was a perfect right hand chop over the top. Marquez missing and missing again. Barrero's left hooks has given a lot of problems to Marquez. And he's mixing up the left hooks. He's on body punches and punches to the head, all with the left hook. Through all of his career, he's had one of the better left hooks in the biz. Jabs with his attack. And then counter punch it very Marquez overreached, stepped inside and landed a body shot. Now Marquez lands a big left hook. Barrera land. Beginning to pick off punches with his gloves now. Seeing it coming just a little. They all use a finish up with right hands, followed up with left hooks. Whether it's a hook to the body or a hook on the chin. See all night long. Technical skill at its highest level. No way. Where sticks the jab again. Sticks the jab again. Sticks go. He's made the transition from being a, a baby-faced assassin. Things, and I think as the fight goes on, it's going to be much more intense. Like this. Yeah, and you can't beat this, Shepard. Just not act with pinpoint punches. The world has got a strange jab. It looks a little awkward the way he does it. Right here, you see one of the characteristics that has made Barrera such a great fighter. Anytime he gets hit with anything, he always comes back with punches. Marco Antonio Barrera. Jim, I gotta tell you, Marquez on the other hand, always a slow starter. I made it close. I guess he's gonna turn because that's how one that one that one. Easy when rounds are the Marquez does not want Barrera to get going for a business jab because once Barrera gets his jab off rhythm jab, he throws yeah, it at the yeah. moment when you're not expecting it. By Marquez, he may try to do more of that with the body punching stock in past fights. But Barrera won't have enough room to roll it off if the fight goes on. A tactical round four. Barrera seems to have confidence at this point that he can win the boxing match in his count against Marquez. And Barrera oh. steps forward with a perfect one, too. Marquez is still punching very short, active power punches. You know he hasn't been that effective. I'm just seeing it look like that's the shot that he was, he's really gambling on a lot. But in terms of solid connects, Marco Antonio Barrera is 
being the boss once again in round four. Right here you see Marquez landing, which I think is the punch that he's gambling on to win this fight for the most, it's that right hand. And I, it seemed like he's trying to get himself. Harold Letterman gives a round. Between these two men. Yeah. They score and score and score. Exactly right, uh, Emmanuel, that he doesn't, that things are not going that. But Marquez is fighting an extremely determined fight. I see a man, I'm looking at his face. He is determined to fight the fight of his life. I was down a stretch when neither guy. Marquez has landed one sharp right hand in this round. There's a, as it did in no. rounds three and four. I'm making him uncomfortable because he really hasn't attacked him very often. The last fight. This is a t big uppercut for Marquez. You heard left hook for Barrera. Good left hook. In Marquez missing with a long right hand. Barrera sticks the jab, yep. sticks the jab, yeah. sticks the jab, moves in a radial circle. Marquez with a big left hook. Barrera caused by punt. I'm looking for left hook for Marquez. Bangs Barrera back again. Forward more than before. Where Barrera mixes up. Barrera going to the body. Marquez going to the body. Left hook. So Another big right hand for Barrera. Hot shotting Marquez. Trying to find that spot around the eye. We're already a hard right hand lead on Manuel Marquez. Now Barrera comes back and fires. against holding crowd doesn't like that big left hook Herrera's had a much more aggressive round here seeming to understand that he about using his head definitely's called but it's what's interesting right now Herrera's trying to throw right hand leads they trade combinations in the center of the ring and both men land a fight breaks out in the middle of the boxing match Marquez 14 out of 42 throwing more 56 Four rounds to two, Marco Antonio Barrera. One guy's landed a heart of shots. I don't know why. This fight is about as close as it can. Tacticians, two great adjusters, two aggressive fight. One of these guys, you know, knowing that the fight is on the decided edge. Oh, right, right, right hand right by right. Marquez. Yeah, yeah, Momentarily right. stones Barrera. Barrera. Yeah. for fighting back. That was the most eye-catching yeah. shot of the night. Another big uppercut for Marquez. Snaps Barrera's head back. And a big right hand over the top. Far to center of the ring. Been really gambling on that punch all night Big long. left hook for Marquez. Suddenly he's beating Barrera to the punch. Over and over. She waits the seventh round. Uppercut for Marquez. Left hook. Barrera stunned. And in trouble. Bobbles back against the rope. Marquez looking to knock his man out. But he's More trouble than anybody else against Manny Pacquiao Seriously. in the course of the past several years. Juan Manuel Marquez straked him with a series of power shots. And Barrera comes back with a right hand. And knocks Marquez down. Amazing. In a round that was almost 10-8, Marquez, Barrera scores the knockdown. Wait, but Jay Nady. Here's the right hand that hurts Barrera so badly. And he's been... Here's the end of the round. Right, right, right on the right, chin. Right hand. It was a right. How could that not be a knockdown? That's a knockdown. That is a perfect knockdown. He hit him with a perfect right hand shot, and his knee went to the canvas. That was a knockdown. And if it's not ruled a knockdown, that's a terrible error. And he took away a point when in fact it should have landslide in copy box where Marquez that ruling is going to figure in but on Barrera at the end of the round two which wouldn't have been surprising big uppercut lands for Marquez suddenly Barrera has no way to solve Marquez's power put knockdown you don't want to see a fight like this referee's mistake let's see how it plays out he might have been ruling a knockdown for Barrera Excellent right point, hand. Jim. Great right hand. What a great fight. Technical boxing match tonight. 
Emmanuel, you pop. Kez is the way that he was when he was fresher. And that's still a big danger of him getting caught with the right hand. And as you can... And now you can almost feel the crowd getting momentary break as Marco Antonio Barrera continues to try to even the score and get back what he lost in the seventh round. On which Jay, Rady, Jay Nady ruled not a knockdown. Boom! Perfect right hand shot. Down goes Marquez. That's a knockdown. That's definitely a knockdown, and it can maybe be a big factor in the, if this fight goes to a decision, too. Particularly when it wound up being a penalty point against Marco Antonio Barrera. What the justification is for that, I have no idea. Well, he did hit him when he was down, Jim. Uh, oh, yes, Jay Nady right. was right. He hit him with a shot on top of the head. Yep, that's right. And okay, he so was that, correct. that point can be made. And this looks, this fight doesn't look like it's percent. Barrero with an edge and jab connects. Mark has a few rounds. Marquez is left. The right, the left is puffed, the right is closed. With short punches, right night. Instead of fighting at a distance. But you're right. Big left hook for Marquez. And he's standing up a little bit better to Marquez's shots and landing his own. A few months older. But he's not showing that tonight. What an upset and stage a late rally. Well, he's doing it right now. Pace now. And Marquez is trying to figure out what the well, that three-point swing is a huge swing. Body shots by Marquez and a big right hand up there. Barrera comes back with a flurry of his own. Right here, you see Barrera coming back with right hands of his own now. He's becoming much more aggressive and trying to get very close because... And they differ by one in the number of punches landed. Marquez lands a big right hand. They rally in the center of the ring. Harold, the fact that Barrera gets off first. When he does that, they see it. He lands the cleanest shots. And that... So both fighters are bloodied around the eyes. There's one thing is not too many butts uh, being uh, in this entire fight. Most whatever happens is usually from punching. it around number 10. And Barrera. Strafing Barrera with body shots and uppercuts. Like round seven again. As Barrera is the slower of the two, and Marquez is landing it. Yes. He's switching back and forth as the fight goes on. Now Barrera gets in a left hook. Ducks a right hand. Solid momentarily knocks Marquez off balance. Barrera gets in a little left hand uppercut. Marquez tries his uppercut again, leaping with the left hook. Barrera fires his own left hook and lands it. See if Barrera throws in a late rally. They trade shots at the center of the ring. Here you see Marquez landing the right hand, but you notice he threw a left hook before he threw the right hand this time, and that kind of distorted. Instant. Not ruled a knockdown, but we're... Maybe based on that score and Big left hook by Marquez. Marquez. Back comes the... Solid contact there for Marquez. Barrera landed to the body. Marquez landed up there. Now Marquez. Good. You know, whatever the outcome of this fight, from Marquez's point of view, he is showing everybody... As I said earlier, if I was having Barrera, this is the last guy in the world that I would in a fight. And it's why I wouldn't let him Nassim Hamed box him. When I, when well, I, I started to say, him. when you were training yeah. Prince Nassim yeah. Hamed, he openly ducked Marquez for right. two years. He's always, to me, been maybe the best featherweight in the world, just not normal. Even when we had the big fame with Morales and him, I thought he should have been right up there with Barrera and Morales. Both fighters trying to make statements for the judge as the 12th round begins in Las Vegas. Big... Hey. Barrera... Inside the storm, Marquez trying to land something big. Throws a little right hand, jabs and beats Marquez to the punch. Marquez lands a left hook. Big left hook for Marquez. Barrera lands a trading punches down the stretch. Another big left hook from his long and difficult career. Marquez shows his tremendous desire to finally win a big fight. He's back and strafes him with a left hook. Takes a left hook on the chin. Hits him back with one of his arms. Fifteen. Back in the day. Our shots for Mark Arrow lands a left hook and steps away. 
Hard right hand for Barrera. Marquez fighting through the flowing blood. Who will rally last? Barrera lands two shots. Marquez tries again. Barrera with the right hand. Big left hook for Marquez. And the bell ends the drama. What a fight. By unanimous decision, and new WBC Super Featherweight Champion of the World, Juan Manuel Dinamita.